All right, Lisa writes. Or right, Lisa writes. Question, my boyfriend and I have been together for a year and a half. My parents are deceased and his mom lives with him. Uh, cultural expectation. Should I be concerned he hasn't introduced me to her? Whoa, a year and a half? Yeah, I'd be concerned. Now, there's a slight chance. Now, have you been to his home? Okay, wait, did you say, have you been to his home? Let me see that. Uh, have you been to his home? So, Lisa, uh, there's possibility he might be feeling a bit of shame centered around having to take care of his mother, and he feels a level of embarrassment. So that's possibly the reason why. However, here's, and I'm assuming he's a younger guy because, um, well, no, that's not the case because you said your parents are deceased. Here's the thing. I would hope a man wants to show off his girlfriend to his parents. One of the, folks, there's a picture of my mom and dad. My mom and dad were married 66 years before my mom passed away. One of the, my saddest, my, one of my regrets is that my mom now won't meet any future person in my life, of my future spouse, you know? I would want to introduce, uh, I'm a big believer of introducing your family and friends. Some When you've decided to be boyfriend and girlfriend with one another, when you've decided to be boyfriend and girlfriend with one another, one another. You've spent a fair, you've spent a minimum of a hundred hours of face-to-face -face time together. That would be a good time after a hundred hours of face-to-face -face time to start incorporating somebody into your life. And so that would include parents. So I would ask him, why haven't you introduced me to my, your mother? Okay. So let me backtrack. By the way, the coffee mug says, let that shit go. And by the way, for those who are going to criticize my shirt, I know last one you criticized the color was wrong. You're probably going to say the color is wrong on this. I'm getting tired. Please, please don't criticize what I wear. If you like it, then express it, but don't criticize it if you don't like it. I know some women say that color isn't you. So what you might want to do, Lisa, is to be curious. Hey, Tim, I'm really curious. Or Jose. <laughs> I'm just going to, Tim, Jose, Jonathan, whatever the name is. Um, Tim, I'm really curious why you haven't introduced me to your, your mom. I would think that you would like to introduce me to your mom. I'm just curious why that is the case. Just simply come from a place of curiosity. You don't have to say it exactly the way I said it, but come from a place of curiosity by asking a question and then see how he responds because how he responds is going to be the red flag. Yes, it's a red flag. He hasn't done it. There could be shame. But why not ask him and then make the decision of whether or not that is a red flag or not? Thank you so much for that question. I really appreciate it, Lisa. Oops. All right. 